is a beautiful, cold, crisp morning here in the state of Kansas. It's about 22 degrees right now. I feel like I'm dressed for deer hunting, but it is opening morning of shotgun turkey here in Kansas. I am on um, a farm that uh, my family owns, a little 80 acres. I've got birds roosted on both sides of me. Um, unfortunately, they're not roosted on my property. Um, they're on the neighbors. Um, actually two different sets of neighbors but there's a ton of sign right here on my place and I've seen them here a couple different times on my place um, in the last week there's a lot of scratching and a lot of tracks and stuff like that out here um, in my bean field so I'm just gonna kind of set up here um, spend the morning for a couple hours I think they eventually work off the pasture land into my field here so uh, we're just gonna sit back relax I've got the uh, single shot Henry 20 gauge right here. And we're gonna see if we can't uh, put a turkey down this morning. We will see what happens. Wish me luck. Jake friend over here is finally starting to walk away and he's still standing on top of the hill here. Unfortunately, uh, his friends, the bigger toms, did not come over here. And uh, with as many toms as I know are around here, I hate to shoot a Jake. You know, last year I shot a couple Jakes because uh, we struggled. It was tough. It, we didn't have the birds that we normally have and uh, we elected to put some meat in the freezer. But uh, since it's opening day, and this dude needs some, I don't know, he needs some help. He's not very smart. 
I decided not to shoot him. He's not the sharpest tool in the shed, let's just say that. I'm gonna sit here for a little while though. Might sneak up over the hill, see if I can see anything. There's a whole bunch of toms on the other side of the fence, but I think they got a bunch of hens, so later in the morning here, they might break off and and uh, start splitting up a little bit and come over here maybe, so we'll see what happens. I might be able to pet this turkey. I'm really starting to think I could probably pet him. Come here, buddy. Come here, bud. Come here. Sweet talk, yeah. See you later, bud. It was nice to meet you. Have a good day. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, good morning, Henry family. Um, it's a beautiful morning this morning. I am back in Kansas in the place that I've been hunting the last couple days in the exact same spot. I'm just trying to, you know, wait these birds out right here. Yesterday morning was kind of a waste of time. Um, we had some really bad wind yesterday morning. Um, it was 20 plus at sun up. They didn't even gobble on the roost. Um, it wasn't very good. This morning, Fairly light winds gusting to maybe 10 here and there, um, but there's birds gobbling all the way around me. None are terribly close, um, but they love to come to this field at some point during the morning. Um, yesterday I didn't stay long just because I didn't hear a whole lot. It was cold, windy. Um, I decided to head home and get some work done today. I'm gonna plan on sitting here for quite a while. I brought me a nice comfy chair, <laughs> a little low profile turkey chair to sit on so I'm comfortable so I can sit here for several hours. Um, I'm just gonna wait them out in here. There's several, several birds, several gobblers gobbling over here. There's several more gobbling over the hill a little further away. These ones here are not that far. I'd say 500 yards or so. Um, they like that, like I said, they love to come to this field. So I'm gonna wait them out. Got the Henry 20 gauge single shot. I'm itching. I'm itching to shoot one in the face with this gun for sure. They just gobbled back over here. So wish me luck, folks. I need it. Man, they are gobbling like crazy this morning. Birds are chirping. It's beautiful. I don't know if you could hear that because the microphone's facing this way, but they're hammering over here. Could be a fun morning, we'll see.
lucky tag filled. This other one's still out here. They didn't come into the decoys like I wanted. They were a little sketchy of them. I'll just tell you, you can take this 20 gauge Henry and kill them at a long range with good shotgun shells and a good choke. I was about a 40 yard shot. Smoked him. <laughs> yes. I could kill this other one right now. I wish I had another tag, man. Dang it. Whew, I am shaking. Oh my gosh, what a deal. Kansas turkey tag bunch, ladies and gents, on an awesome hunt. Those birds come from a mile away. Awesome. I'm gonna sit here a minute and go get him. <laughs> All right guys, I'm getting out of the blind here. I'm gonna show you my little blind I made. I just put some cedars here in front. Got a little chair in there with me this morning, my tripod and stuff. Uh, I sat here four different times. It's about the only place I can sit on this farm and uh, have a good chance at a turkey because they really just don't come anywhere else but right here in this corner because um, they stay mostly on the neighboring properties. As you guys saw, these birds come across the fence to me. Um, so I made this little blind mostly because in the evenings, the sun's going down over here in the west, obviously and sun can be beaming on you sometimes so i wanted some cover in case i wanted to hunt here in the evenings um, but in the mornings it's perfect sun behind you this, and this morning was perfect these birds come in it's awesome oh, they gobbled the whole way these birds were literally roosted um, i'm not kidding you when i say possibly a mile away um, <clears throat> they were way 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 down in here um, I thought I was gonna actually kill these birds over here, but these were the ones that came in. There's two of them. If I would have bought my other tag, I could have got you guys a double, but I just didn't buy one. I just didn't know, um, you know, if I'd have a chance to kill another one in Kansas. But <laughs> let's take a look at this bird. He looks pretty. <laughs> wow, what a pretty bird. Man, this thing is dang near white. That's one of the lighter color birds I've uh, killed around here. Real pretty bird. Got some good spurs on him. Looks like a pretty good beard as well. Hopefully you can see that. <laughs> Doing this all myself this morning, but man, what a morning. This is the first turkey I've ever killed on this farm. Um, definitely feel blessed. I killed another one uh, right behind my house with a bow earlier in the year in Nebraska been a heck of a turkey season so far so uh, I appreciate you guys uh, following along and I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this episode of hunt with Henry I definitely enjoyed bringing it to you as always turkey down turkey down <laughs> God bless guys we'll see you in the next one <laughs>